Okay, after so long, it is time for my first female interviewee, Sandy. Yeehaw! Get out, little fishies! Ahoy, Sandy! Oh! Hot cat snake in a ball! What? Surprised to see an air breather around here without a helmet? I hate to precipitate on your party, but that is impossible! No air breather could ever do that! Not even me! Well, I've been doing just fine down here for a good while, so let's just move on. What brings you out to this fine neck of the woods? Oh, I just wanted to bring up to you about how when you and Spongebob first met, you acted quite... not smart. Let's just put it that way. What do you mean by that? Well, I mean with how you're a scientist and all, and, you know, you've been around the sea, and, you know, all the basics of underwater life and all, it just didn't make any dang sense why you would just not notice Spongebob in his predicament. Are you suggesting I'm dumb? Well, no, I was saying that you are, or were at the time, extremely out of character. I think you'd better leave. Wait, what if I give you a bowl of my famous peanut butter? Woo! Good, so, can I stay? Rashy sore! I mean, sure! Alright, now, next question. So, um, uh, you're the first female that I've interviewed down here, right? So, I kinda wanna ask you a little thing. Um, okay, I'll just get straight to the chase. How do I look? You're about as ugly as homemade soup. Oh yeah? Well, you're about as tasty as homemade soup. What do you mean by that? Well, I mean a meal that was enjoyed by two different American presidents, and even some people in eastern Texas, is... squirrel soup. I think you'd better leave. Okay, yeah, I clearly went too far this time. But before I go... Can I have you know your better recipe? I guess not. <laughs>